Hello, I'm going to show you some uh, new functionalities uh, with uh, Miranda uh, to use uh, Lego EV3 uh, bricks and uh, items. Firstly, we are going to see that uh, now in the device editor we have a new category called Lego. And inside this category I have the main EV3 items. Uh, let's create a small robot with some of these items. I'm adding a brick. Then I'm going to add one motor. Then another motor. Okay, uh, now I'm going to add some wheel to each motor okay um, I also need to connect uh, the motors to the port of the brick so let's do it with the left motor to the port A and with the right motor with the port B I can also uh, add the other items of the Miranda device editor, example, a sphere to uh, add a, a third point of contact on this part of the robot. So I'm going to resize the sphere. Oh, I think. I didn't associate the sphere to the brick, so I'm going simply to drag and drop the sphere. Okay, now it's okay. I'm going to move the sphere. Okay, can also set up the mass. Uh, let's have a a little try okay seems okay I can also define the starting rotation and position of my robot okay not too bad now I'm going to uh, save my robot so I can give it a name for the category Okay, and now I'm saving my robot. I give a name on here. Okay, now I quit the device editor. I go to the scene editor. adding one device so I should see my new category with my robot and then I can program it uh, with Scratch or Python let's do it firstly with Python Okay, let's try it. Okay, very nice. I can do it uh, with uh, Scratch, so I simply delete the Python program and select Scratch and then write my program with Scratch. and test. Okay, one other very interesting thing is that uh, you can program a real a brick from this program or from the Python program. Both are okay. 
simply by clicking on this button. So if you have a real EV3 Lego brick, uh, you have to uh, install the EV3, D, EV3 div uh, firmware on an SD card. And uh, then directly from Miranda, you can transfer Scratch or Python program to the brick. So with Miranda, you have a full tool chain to uh, design a robot, uh, simulate a behavior, right turn in Scratch or Python, and finally transfer the behavior to a real robot. Thank you very much for your attention.